Hey y'all, welcome back. This is going to be your next 48 for the sign of Aries. If you have Aries anywhere in your chart, these messages may or may not resonate. Please take what apply and leave the rest. If these messages do resonate, please like and subscribe. Anything you need to know about me will be down below in the description box. We're going to start these readings off with some oracle cards. So the first card we have is Graveyard. It says, there is a song that bellows and the peace of knowing no end and acknowledging the crossword, crossroads of eternity. So this can be a death to a situation or there could be a death in the family. We have grief. It says, it is but a mere glimpse of nothingness hitting away deep within the chambers of your murmuring and the red clover's birthing lost illusions. So someone could be going through some sort of um, Sadness, loneliness. Um, we have the wolf here. It says, devour the furious calling within the howling of your spirit. Run wildly into the freedom of your knowing. With this car, I feel like something could, someone's activities or the way somebody's acting could be very curious. You could be curious about the way somebody's acting. Somebody could be going through some sort of rebirth here. Or the graveyard, or there could be a death of something. We have a candle magic. It says, speak your breath into its velvet. Recite along its spine all that you desire, all that which will unravel. So somebody could have been doing um, candle magic on somebody. And then we have coming of winter. So something could be happening in the winter time. There could be some sort of death that happens in the winter time. Somebody could be passing away in the winter. Let's see. Clarify this message, please. We have the five of cups here. Like I said, somebody could be in regret or feeling at a loss or feeling like they lost someone. Someone could be sad and grieving over a death here. Yeah, somebody is heartbroken here with the three of swords. We have the ace of cups here. Somebody could be heartbroken over some sort of new love or new start. Or somebody else's new love or new start in something. I also want to say new opportunity. Yeah, we have we have the nine of swords. Somebody could be worried, having anxiety, stressing out about this. It has something to do with a father. Yeah, we have the will of fortune here. And then we have the death card again. Yeah, there was some sort of fated event that happened here that caused some sort of death. Like I said, this can be a change of a situation. Somebody could have went through a rebirth or somebody could have like really experienced some sort of act, like an actual death here. Like somebody actually dying. Like I said, somebody could have been doing some sort of candle magic on somebody. What's the candle magic card, Spirit? Spirit? We have the four swords. Yeah, somebody, somebody could be thinking about this, or it, they could be all in their head thinking about what they did to someone. Could, could they could have been doing candle magic on somebody's finances, and now they're now realizing that something is backfiring on them. It's causing their situation to change drastically. Yeah, we got the seven the pentacles here. Like somebody was invested. Somebody was invested. And to, like, they was investing their time and energy into doing something here. We got the, the page of wands and then the moon card. Somebody could have called somebody out on some, some sort of secret here. There could be some news coming in. Somebody could be calling you. Somebody could be giving, somebody could be, um, somebody could have called you, right? 
and expose some sort of secret to you. So a phone call came in about a secret and I feel like somebody illuminated something, like something was illuminated to you. Something was shown to you or somebody showed something to you or somebody told you something that was hidden. Yeah, we got the Eight of Pentacles and the Queen of Cups. I feel like somebody could have been working on somebody else's emotions here. Somebody could have also been doing work on somebody's emotions or mental state. Somebody could have been, like, somebody could have been um doing candle magic to mess with somebody's mental state. But we have a high priestess here. I feel like this person knew this. This person could have been a tarot card reader or a psychic. Yeah, but we have justice here. So justice is, justice is now being served because of this. I feel like whatever was going on, somebody was doing some sort of, like, candle magic on somebody's finances, somebody's mental, like, their mental state. And I feel like there's something, there's a drastic change happening here. Something is something is coming to a drastic end or some, something is changing. Somebody could have also been doing um, death spells on somebody. I feel like justice is now being served. Or justice will be getting served here in this situation. <clears throat> and we have the Knight of Cups. There could be somebody coming in with an offer. Yeah. Somebody came in with an offer or a proposal here for the with the four of wands. Somebody could be wanting to offer somebody some sort of um um new new foundation, like new um I could be offering someone like a, a um some sort of stability here, like when it comes to your foundation, a new beginning with your stability or some shit like that. Yeah, we got the sun car here. Something was successful here. Oh, somebody came in and made an offer or a proposal here. I feel like it's 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 gonna be a success or it was successful. Something went through. Can also be a new home coming in as well. Yeah, we got the nine of cups here. So many wishes are coming through. Like I said, you could have been dealing with a high priestess, a uh, uh, a psychic or a tarot card reader. Somebody could have been doing this to a tarot card reader or a psychic. Yep, we got the two of cups here. A soulmate connection. Somebody could have been doing this to a soulmate, to, to, to two people, or they could have been doing this to people that were in love with each other. Some sort of soulmate connection, like I said. Yeah, we got the we got the Knight of Pentacles. I feel like they were trying to slow down these people's money. Or somebody could have been doing this to you. Somebody could have been trying to slow down somebody's finances here, but I feel like their finances were protected. Because the Knight of, the Knight of Pentacles is protection. We also have the Eight of Cups. Somebody could have been doing this also to somebody because they walked away. They walked away from them. We got the Devil card. Yeah. Somebody walked away because they realized somebody was toxic here. Or somebody was trying to do like, like they were trying to do some sort of um bind spells. Keep you bind to them or bound to them. Somebody could have also been trying to manipulate you. Yeah. They could have been also doing some sort of chaos magic as well because we have the five of wands here. Yep, we got the two of swords. Somebody was trying to keep somebody stagnant. Somebody was trying to make somebody indecisive when it came to this um, relationship, this soulmate connection here. Yeah, somebody wanted somebody to juggle someone. Or you could have found out this person was juggling you the whole time. Yep, look at that. You got the ace of swords. That's the truth. But we have the six of pentacles here. Somebody is somebody is um somebody's going to be getting patronized here. Okay, what other messages do you have for Aries? We have mirror magic. It says lunar light, past lives, spectrum, and self-care. 
Yeah, somebody was definitely doing some sort of moon magic, trying to project on somebody else. Somebody could have been doing moon magic, candle magic, all types of um like black magic spell work on somebody's um mental state, their finances, their civility, their relationship. We have raising winds. It says magical release, calling, intentions, stronghold. Yeah, somebody could have been like vibrating at a very high energy. Somebody could have been also using magic to release themselves from whatever it was that people were trying to put on them. This person could have been very magical. This person had good intentions as well. Or they were call it they were calling in good things to happen for them, which is why they're being released from whatever it was that people were doing to them. Yeah, we have dingy. It says wildness, enema, service, and choices. Somebody could have, um, with this card, I always feel like somebody has some sort of, um, they had two powers here. They had dark power and a light power. Somebody could have also been able to choose between light and dark. Look at this card here. This card is also speaking about choices. Yeah, but I feel like this person chose light here. Whatever it was, they always chose the light. The light side, when it came to their power, they never they never worked with dark energy. But I feel like somebody was that was like doing all this black magic and spell work on whoever this was. Like they was doing all this black magic and spell work on somebody's connection, their finances, their mental state, their stability, like I said, everything. And I feel like it's because they could have been jealous because this person had two powers here. This person had two, two powers to choose from. But I feel like this person always chose light. I want to get a blessing message for y'all too. I don't think I'm going to be able to find my call real quick. All right, y'all. My car is in my book bag. Okay. So I'm going to give y'all a blessing message and then I'm going to let y'all go. Yeah, what blessing message do you have for the Aries? We have a blessing of air. This could have been an air sign you were dealing with. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. And we have a blessing on a friendship. Yeah. So somebody could also been um i don't know it could have been somebody you was friends with or you thought this person was your friend or some shit like that yeah but we also have a blessing to safe to shield and safeguard you yeah so somebody was like protected here like highly protected yeah somebody was highly protected here this person could have also been trying to act like they were your, like I said, act like they were your friend or some shit like that. But that's all I have for you guys. Um, I'll definitely be back, so please stay tuned. I'm out.